William Morales. Cruz. And it's done for innovation. On the run, Gittins. Left to right your screen. Driving in and Tony. A possible three-point play for Dominic Gittins. And Tex on the board. A bit too much on the right side. Home run pass to Orby. Orby going downhill. Drew the contact. And Tony it again. Another possible three-point play for Tex. Points. Muhammad Kule going downhill. No. And Sadiq on the rack attack. It's a full packed here for an early Sunday morning game. Kudos to the fans. Kool-Aid goes up high and counted. A possible three-point play again, this time for the Ravens. And I'm telling you, downhill. Absorbs a contact, puts it high off the glass. The hoop in the horn. Sadiq then throws it right back to Tech. That's Camaro. He's working against Kool-Aid. He reverses right side, and the attack by Gaines. He had himself a rack attack, seven for Tech has 17 on the shot clock. They lead 19 to 14. Gittins off the glass and another possible three-point play. Cruz going down the baseline, closes to us. Cruz makes a Euro step, can't finish. Sadiq on the putback. It's a four-nothing run. Go inbounding. Franco to Cruz. The short J is good by Cruz. He'll finish the third quarter with six. Four coming in the third. And it Guarded by Kulev, and he had his pocket picked. It's all by his lonesome is kool -Aid. and he'll score in the right low post. Five. Deep, moving with the ball, goes outside to Cruz. Cruz decides to drive. Cruz was fouled, and count it as he shows emotion. And the young man, it's going to be Gins. He gets by two. He's got Cruz in front, and Gins with the finish. Gins with 19. Now Jamal kool -Aid guarded by Orby. It's a three-point lead for the Ravens. Cruz trying to make it six, and he does. It's a pure three from Amari Cruz, his first made three. Of the Innovation leads, but then Gaines with the answer back, a possible three-point play. Key, that's Cruz, he's had quite a second half. He feeds Sadiq, the dime by Cruz was good. Point lead for said Innovation. Three by Morales, gets the three, you cannot leave him open. He's got five to have. No foul call. The Innovation Ravens have won their second title in program history. 55 to 48 is the final as they swarm Mad Lance on the opposite side of the court. Innovation was down for over two plus quarters and they were able to come back. Fantastic game that we were able to witness here at a historic arena at Mohegan Sun. The most outstanding player who will be with Gittins is going to be tough to replace. But do you think about how, how much of a ceiling that they have? Game ball being brought up. Uniforms trimmed in red and white. Thomas been in their home white uniforms trimmed in brown and gold and just like that. Tries to give into the paint to Harkness and she throws it away. Cassidy trying to come ahead, go coast to coast. She'll drive, lay it up, and in. Shorts of contact. Spartans able to bring it ahead into their front court. Wood in the corner gave for Kern. Out up top, Skalski. Her three is good. Showing her versatility because she's got opportunities. The offensive end just not able to convert. That three is put up short. Offensive rebound, put back by Skalski. Got Wood rather. Right of the baseline. That's Harkness laid it in. That was a chance to cut into the lead even more. Bears pushing it ahead. Aliou's baseline jumper is good. Four straight by Aliou. Gives back for Harkness. He's double teamed. Hands for Patchell, and she buries the 15 footer. With four. Driving. She's got to be careful. She'll lay it in. Good stroke. Ava Harkness picks it up. Her second. Couldn't get a shot off. Now the pass into the paint for Harkness. Feeds down low for Patchell, and that shot is blocked out of bounds by Wood. Baseline jumpers put up and in. 41-39. And the steal by Skalski. 
Driving. Her leaner is good. Absorbed a little bit of contact. It's going to change this game in a hurry when they start falling out. That's a tough shot that Wood is able to hit. Spartans break the pressure ahead. Wood driving, lays it in. And Summers will just let it run out. And that is it. Summers High School has won the Class S girls title. Second half, especially the fourth quarter for Summers in that victory. Outstanding season. The Summer Spartans, ladies and gentlemen. She was like, you know what? I want to get back into it. I want to get back to the game. And she knows a thing or two. Her parents were good friends. We're 21 years old. But in conversations I've had with some people around, down offense is Coventry left to right on your screen. Jamel, offensive foul. Good job by the freshman. To the bench of Coventry, it stays. Five on the shot clock, down to four, down to three. Bangs and a three! So Lime, they ended the first quarter leading seven to four. A steal by Old Lime. Going downhill again and getting the money in the right. To BC. BC, give and go, right low post, strong. Koval scores. He Reardon trying to get the ball in, has to quickly. He does, but then it's intercepted by Coventry. Working down and scoring was Aloisa. Corner. Old Lime in their white with blue numbers. Finds an opening. Sahadi, the senior scores. The dime by the younger and the older scores. He gets the ball back for three. And buries the three. Aiden Hecht. And that's going to. Trying to get it to Sahadi. It's taken away by Coventry. Goble. Downhill correction. That's Cordner. He scores. Old Lime going through their offense. That's Porter. The defense by Coventry forces the turnover. BC, downhill, left hand, and he gets the roll. Sahadi, opposite end, goes in the corner, another three. This time it finds it, number 11, Porter. Older Sahadi, Charles, missed the three, offensive rebound, left hand, good. This time by rear. Sahadi, feeds Hine, Hine the toss, top of the key three, it's pure. Sahadi. Sometimes I've heard the hook and ladder is hecked. Trying to find Koval, it's intercepted by Fish Jr. Sahadi scores. This time, this is Elias Sahadi. Title ever. They're going to need the freshman. Run at one point here in the fourth quarter. The freshman, and it's going to count. Apostle three point play for Fish Jr. Old Lime's been knocking on the door what seems like forever. This time, they barrel through it. They are your Division V final champion. They get their title, their first in program history. What so proudly we held at Push it up and down the floor. Donnarubo. That was a long two rim. Another offensive rebound. This time it's Moore. He finds Brookshire and the foul. Leah Philpotts with it. Down the lane, Leah Philpotts and one. This is a big possession here for Sacred Heart. They need some points. And they get them from Megan Kirk. She hits the three. Starts with a takeaway, long pass for Thompson. And she scores. Four points. Leah Philpotts. Underneath Brookshire. Burke got a block. But she couldn't squeeze it. Miller. 
Thompson. That's a three. It's good. Warren Thompson. Second three for Silver Heart Academy. Back within seven and a steal. Manillo for two. And that's the first time that trapping press. Leah Philpotts. Now it's Sister Alana for three. That's good. Loud pass for DeErico, and Lila DeErico hits her Sacred Heart Academy. Megan Kirk for three. Second time today she's hit from down. Pots. Now Alana, back to Leah. Donnarumma for three. Short, but the putback is good. Taylor Haynes, first point. Miller. Miller from the left side and one. Long three attempt is good. Megan Kirk, time out. Sager Hart, attempt. Hart down by six. Long pass is intercepted, and they've done it again. The Hampton Green Dragons win the double L championship. Wrap up the season for Sacred Heart. The Sharks finish. At home and abroad with the performance of our national anthem. And now to perform our national anthem. Garrison. O'Leary open three. Rebound back to O'Leary, another three. That one's good, Colin O'Leary from the corner. I'm running the point, it allows Gray to move off the ball. As it works out well, Gray. Up Church. He's in double digits with 11. And then jump ball being on Notre Dame West Haven's side. One point game, Division I Championship, Senyange. Four three, first point of the day. Just the second three Notre Dame has hit. O'Leary, that's his third. On St. Patrick's Day, Colin O'Leary getting lucky from beyond the yard. Into the next whistle, the only players in more than two as Krieger hits and he'll head to the line. Curtis Marshall, knocked away. Ture ahead of the pass. Abdu Ture! Mangual, Ture with his fifth block. Falls to Curtis Marshall, and he gets it to go with the right hand. Eight points now for Ray. Swanson open three. His first points to. Up top for Swanson. He has a lane, and the left hand. Finger roll for Swanson. The wait is over. Nerdy wins the first title in school history. Now, Tom, as far as the most outstanding, one of those situations where who do you, who do you give the award to? Well, it's Frank Vanesky. They're there for people to kind of come around, but or maybe even East Catholic losing, right? I mean... Yeah, when East Catholic... And champions, the Green Knights of Notre Dame West Haven! Their legacies, Tom, forever will be remembered.